Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do something that I have been dying to do for a couple of weeks now. And uh, just before I go into this, um, I like to review diaper bags and just any old bag that I may have that I purpose as a diaper bag. Um, and again, just my own personal disclaimer, these are my personal bags that I use in my day to day life. So I try to provide as honest feedback as I can and uh, by no means am I a professional or do I know all these names of these prints and all these fancy things, but I hope that you enjoy watching and today this for me is really, really special. I'm going to go right into it. So first of all, can I just say, look, I want to make sure that the camera is getting this. This is in a diaper box, okay? Can I just say... Girl, you are the MVP because my husband was home the day that this came in and he thought that these were diapers or actually I think wipes. Yes, this is a wipes box. So he did not even give it a second glance because it is in a baby box. So girl, you are the real MVP and I really appreciate you throwing it in this type of box. Maybe it was intentional, maybe it wasn't. Um, it was great that it came in this box because he actually opened the door and brought it inside. He asked me what it was and I was like, oh, I'm not sure. Must be wipes or diapers or something. So I have been patiently waiting. I just had a lot of stuff going on this month. So it's been really hard for me to try and uh, uh, film a video. So today I thought I would make a little time. Both of the kids are a little bit sick, so they're napping right now, hopefully for the length of this video. So I don't know how she's packaged it or whatnot, but to me, this is very special because I have been wanting this particular bag and in this particular print, for a really, really long time. And I got it at a really good price, I would say. Oh man, that's just gonna come with it. Okay, so she did a really good job packing it up. Okay, deep breaths. So I got this one off the BST. So for those of you that don't know what that is, the Buy Sell Trade group on Facebook, and this is the JGB group. I don't remember which JGB group, but oh my gosh, oh my gosh, my heart is racing, like racing, racing. I love that she threw in a tea, like a aqua green bag for it too, kind of matches the lining. Again, I don't know if that was intentional, but um right for me so let me just get out this beauty oh my goodness okay so just to be clear guys this is the first time I'm so excited that I actually lay eyes on this bag myself and I get to actually touch it it's been in my house since the first week of um of October but I've had a lot going on so I just didn't have the chance and I really wanted to make this one special it doesn't even look like she used it to be honest like look at it it's just like it looks brand new wow I am so so happy and you know with it being fall and all I didn't really feel like okay I don't really need to be using a pink bag right now at this very moment because I've been using um Lily Jade really often because I got another one yeah that's a whole other story and funny story about this wallet so I originally sold her this wallet and she threw it in for free with the bag because I guess it didn't work for her or she's moved away from the print it is uh, well loved but you know what it made its way back to me when I sold it, I kind of regretted selling it afterwards. Um, I got it on the buy, sell, trade, and I, immediately I thought, it's not for me. It's just not what I was looking for. But looking at it now, oh my gosh, I'm like panting. I'm so excited. Um, I really like it. So I just want to go through the bag real quick. And I know that this is not a new bag. I know this is not a new style. But this is my first ever BFF. 
And I can tell that she will be my BFF because I'm already loving the structure to it and all the organization. So I'm really happy. And I have a bunch of things to go with this bag. So I'm gonna just go through briefly my collection, but I just wanted to show you guys these awesome straps. So this is obviously the, the crossbody or the messenger strap. Make sure I'm getting it. Actually, let me just put this off to a side. But this is really neat. Like, this is very padded. Again, this is my first BFF, so I'm in awe right now. I am crushing on this bag really hard because it is really beautiful. I love it. Okay, I'm going to stop gushing over this. And I'm just going to bring over all my stuff that has been patiently waiting for this bag. So this little thing that I just recently ordered is from... Her name's Diana from Rose Petal Stitchery, and she is now on Instagram as well, and also on Facebook. So I got this in preparation for this bag, and I have not used it. Um, again, you guys know that I also ordered bag tags from her. So those are here as well. And I will link her page if I can below. So there's a couple of different charms that I have that I feel like are gonna match this bag beautifully. Oh my gosh. Guys, I'm so excited. And I'm, now I feel like I, I should have packed her so much sooner. She's so pretty. Oh my gosh, I can't. I, I really love pink, so this is right up my alley, so. And I got this also off of the BST. This is a, oh, and this print, for those of you guys who don't know, I'm sure everybody who was watching knows by now, is called the Donatella Sweet Shop mm -hmm. by Juju B with Tokidoki, Tokidoki, it's a collab. And here is my medium set piece. And this is also in the same print. And I also have a Be Quick. Again, in that beautiful same print. And of course, a large set piece. And finally, the small set piece. This one's a little bit, got a little bit sign and wear on it a little bit. Might throw it in the wash. Oh, I love that. Love that. Sweet shop. I didn't notice that till now. And recently, I also got this. You might have seen in my other video. The Donatella Y pouch from Se Petite Vienna. I am so stoked, guys. Oh, and last but not least, I have my Passy Pod in the same print as well. So I wanna say I'm pretty much set with this bag, and I just wanted to try out a few different cups that I have, sippy cups. So this one is a replay sippy cup, and this is the rubber spout. I find my toddler is gravitating more towards this one lately. So I just want to pop this in there. And this isn't a packing video. Ooh, perfect. But I thought, you know, might as well, since I have everything to match this bag, why not bring it all out and just go through it? And I'm just going to try and fit my swirl ball in there. Okay, so it does fit. I personally don't like how it kind of like shoving off to the corner there so I might do it on the inside I'm gonna try a snack tower and this is also sorry this is also from replay I keep forgetting where my camera is okay okay so that was a snug fit but it did fit and guys I also have it in in the pink. So the neat thing about the snack towers from Replay is that you can mixy matchy. Is that a word I just made up? Okay. So if you wanted to do that, you can. And they also have their hard spout sippy cups. This is also a Replay cup. I am in love. So I'm just gonna Grab all my pieces and 
put them in there as if I were to pack it. I know obviously these pieces are not packed. Oh, there's nothing in them, but I just want to see how it how it goes. I currently have um, my Lily Jade packed up, so I didn't want to move things around because I didn't know if I would have enough time with the kids, and I just wanted to get to filming right away. Okay, what else can I put in there? Oh, of course, pink power bank, guys. I put this in that front pocket there. I think that's it for there. Because my phone typically would go there, right? Oh my gosh, guys. I am in love with this bag. And obviously they're not packed, but... Oh, I want to see if I take out this one. And I didn't plan this video, guys, as you can tell. I didn't... Oh, okay. You know what? I think I like the bottle in there a lot more than on the outside. So that makes me happy. And then I could just maybe slide my power bank in there instead. I didn't plan this video. I didn't know what to expect. I didn't even know if this bag would have been love for me or, or what, but I'm happy that I did. So I'm gonna put the wallet, and guys, I don't know the name of this wallet. I think it's a Be Rich. I'm gonna just go with that. And using my imagination here, I am going to pretend that those set pieces are packed. And my Y pouch, oh, sorry, I thought that was one of the babies crying. This goes in there. Wow. And maybe, so I've been on not, I don't really want to say it's a planner kind of tip, but I have been loving this notebook that I got recently from Dollarama, and I'm not going to obviously go into detail, but I'm loving it for lists, and I'm always keeping it on me, so I don't like that it falls over. Maybe I could... Perfect. Oh my goodness. Like how beautiful is that? And I'm just gonna load her up with all of the accessories just to see how she looks. Oh man, guys, this bag is so sweet. I'm so happy that I went for this bag okay where should I hang this one from you know you have too many charms when you can't decide where you're gonna hang things from oh that's perfect so this one too oh side one here and I think I heard one of the kitties already so that might mean that this video is now going to end, but I'm glad that I had the opportunity. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, that's it, guys. That's all I have time for today. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching. And please don't forget to like and subscribe and tell me what your favorite print is. If Donatella is the one, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Thanks.